are basically an improved production 325i. Two and a half litre single cam six cylinder with a few race bits inside, standard five speed gearbox, a medium case LSD, uh, 391, so drive lines of control. In my case, I've got some beautiful shocks in it, uh, roll cage seat, safety stuff, a nice 205 AO50 tyre, and away you go. And obviously, rear wheel drive, front engine, really good fun, but yeah, this, this club's unreal. Everybody's always helping each other, really fair out on track, fairly cost effective as far as it goes. It's just a really great way to spend your weekends. I've been in E30 racing my whole life, so as soon as I could drive, I was behind the wheel of an E30. The quality of competitors that we have in E30 racing is top notch, so we have a lot of close racing, a lot of clean racing, and I think it's a great place for young, new, old competitors to come and have fun, have clean racing, go home, have a great weekend. So my dad was one of the founders of E30 Racing, and for me, I know it's just like one big family, so I never left. When you're growing up, you play sport, I did a lot. Over the years as you get older you become uh, less physically capable but uh, inside a nice secure car with a roll cage you can still enjoy a bit of that competitive spirit, have fun and stay safe and uh, enjoy it. I keep coming back because the racing in this category is so good, everyone's really fair, we have a great, great collaborative environment looking after each other's cars and helping each other improve around the tracks. Love coming back and getting involved with it, it's beautiful. A lot of people tend to start with uh, track days through car, the car clubs and a lot, of, a lot of our drivers have gone through BMW Drivers Club and then quite often they'll jump in an E30 or have a go at rent a car, have a go, progress up to E30 racing and yeah, off they go. Uh, the wonderful thing with E30 racing, it's entry level budget racing so you can either rock up on the car with the trailer yourself and work on it in your own garage or you can go as far as having a team run it for you, either way it's still very close racing and uh, yeah, very, very affordable to do. Getting the good opportunity to drive other cars now, uh, such as GT cars and stuff like that, and still love coming back to the E30 racing. We've got a, a solid top six this weekend at Phillip Island, uh, battling out, swapping positions for the leads every lap, and it's just an incredible series. grand a weekend but that usually assuming all goes right you're looking at a couple of grand which will usually cover your accommodation your racing costs your fuel your tires your travel everything so yeah it's really affordable you, you pay a little bit for the uh, the servicing between rounds uh, make sure the oil's good and everything is uh, tight and all the uh, components are in good condition um, and then you just pay for uh, fuel and tires at the race weekend It's like a one big family and I think a lot of people will say that within the uh, competitor group. It's a great race, it's a great series, it's really well ran, um, it's a great environment to be involved in and I think that's a thing that draws me back. And I also love working with the drivers as well, not just on a one-on-one -on -one basis. We get new drivers come into the series like, like we have this weekend, we get to coach them and work with them and that's the stuff that I love and love giving back to the E30 racing series. If you want to go racing, Ideally, you want a car with no assists, rear wheel drive, great chassis, great handling, not too fast, not too slow, and this is the great, perfect match of all those vehicles on, the, uh, on all the racing categories. Um, relatively, it's affordable, you're not going too fast, but you're having an absolute great time. The racing is close, whether it's right up the front at the pointy end with the best competitors, or with those learning further back, there's always great racing. Highly recommend this category to anyone who wants to uh, have a great time on track.